after the ferry journey from uh, Trelleborg to Rostock we drove uh, about 100 kilometers to this place which is uh, a little air in Parchim um, it's by a canal and it has uh, electric points and emptying stuff you know um, over there but um, because it's by a canal they charge uh, six euros for a night for camping and also the charges sort of fit in with the um, with the canal boat thing as well so we're going off for a little walk I'm going to show you a bit around the surroundings here you'll see where we parked the <laughs> it's it's car parking really and you'll see the lines here and you'll see us parked the other way around um, and that is because if we parked that way we'd be sticking out to the middle of the road here and uh, that would never do even even with the overhang sort of parked back over the over the grass that wouldn't um, that wouldn't give us enough room. I did try um, to park it around the right way, but we've uh, we had a knock on the door this morning at about quarter past eight, uh, just to to, to uh, get the money um, six euros. They they sort of come round between sort of where it says eight and nine, half eight and half nine. But not not sure. Um, I think uh, between. 8 and 9 is for the boats, half 8 and half 9 is for the pitches, the camping pitches, for the, the air pitches. Um, but that's where we are. This is uh, Parchim. Now after all day yesterday while I was on the boat, I think you, Wendy said that I was feeling uh, none too well. And uh, that was very, very true. Um, so wasn't it when well, I was very, very ill very poorly in fact last night I went out to, and see if I could have a look round and I got a leaflet about uh, Pippin standing standing about the um, doctors round here oh did you <laughs> I was that ill you were that ill so I was worried we had a um, it was about a two hour drive wasn't it yeah from you know because we don't go fast and I wasn't feeling no, very no. well I kept saying let's um, stop uh, uh. But we, you know, we kept on going. I, I had the massive stomach pains and the shivers beyond belief. Um, so when we got here at about half past five mm. last night, I just uh, effectively I took my shoes off and went to bed, mm. <laughs> and uh, uh, you know, taking painkillers and stomach calming tablets and all the rest of it. Um, feeling a lot better now mm. although not on top form I've still got a massive backache um, mm. it's all part of that I think uh, you know Dr Google sort of leads me to li to believe it's a uh, stomach flu yeah so you know but I, I was unable to um, stop shivering mm. wasn't I you were you were shaking was, and, yeah, like, yeah. the whole body was shaking and all my muscles have been really sore i've been sore really really mm. really awful um like a proper bout of flu it was it yes they say they say it can yeah. take about a week mm. to pass but i have been feeling unwell well, you've got some stomach issues sometimes. So, yeah, yeah i've been know. i've been feeling a bit unwell stomach issues and pains and stuff for for about a week mm. so um Maybe, maybe yeah. I'm on, I'm, then maybe this will mend it. Mm. Maybe the maybe you should keep taking antacids because it could be. I keep taking. <laughs> keep ta taking keep them regularly. Taking the like lots of people have to because well, as you well, get older, your stomach, your light stomach lining is not so good, and your body doesn't deal well with the acid or as well. Yeah. Start eating more sensibly. Yeah. What do you think? Mm. <laughs> well, no, no, no chili tonight. Anyway, no chili. <laughs> no, no, no chilies or anything like that. Curry. I've not no. eaten anything. No. since uh, breakfast yesterday morning oh, no, yeah, no. which was uh, about eight o'clock mm. so and it's now was it now 
nearly 11, mm. isn't nearly it? 11, yes. So I've not eaten a thing. Yeah. I've drank uh, I've drank water, clearly not enough. No. Um, so we need to get some more water while we're out for drinking. Um, I might get one of those energy drinks. Mm. What do you oh, think? Yeah, they're good. Yes, definitely. Because yeah. they rehydrate really, really you as well. Yeah, yeah. They found their So I'll try and get, yeah. get that sorted out. And, um, well, I'll show you a bit more of the surroundings here. Um, but let's show you where we're parked yeah. and the view from there. So here we go. Turn you around. You see, all of these bits here are motorhome parking. Over there is uh, motorhome parking as well. You've got these lovely trees. This is all car parking. It's free car parking. Um, for, to help people go shopping. The town is uh, over that way. So let's just have a, a little look. There's an Irish bar, an Irish pub uh, here as well um, that we that we well Wendy spotted yesterday. <laughs> so excited Not sure we'll about, go in there. So but, but I haven't anyway. seen a pub or a bar for weeks. No, we won't go today. Oh no, 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 no. But it just felt lovely, and there was an outdoor area, sitting area by the canal, and there was a dog on the grass there, and it just felt like a little bit of. England which we so enjoy doing in the good weather and it's supposed to get very nice today so yeah and we can stay here as long as we want so I think we'll probably Seven, spend 17 degrees today yeah and we'll probably spend I don't know yeah. how long but we've got a choice this time so it's yeah. nice we've got yeah. a choice there we go here's some here's some pictures of the surroundings 